All right, so still doing arm bars. Um, so again, your basic five step arm bar, once you're rolling with someone who knows a little bit, it's gonna be real hard to just go for that and get it, so you need to set it up with something else. So today, we're gonna do a real simple sweep um, as a setup to the arm bar. Again, if the sweep works, awesome, do the sweep, right? Just like with the choke yesterday. If the choke works, great. Won't always work though, so you gotta have a backup plan, right? Something else to link it with, okay? So, the flower sweep is a very fundamental basic sweep. It can be done from a bunch of different positions. Basically, any time that I control an arm on one side of his body, okay, I can hit the flower sweep, all right? We're gonna do this one from an overhook. So we're gonna swim in, I'm gonna get the overhook, okay? The flower sweep, if it was to work, would look like this. I'm gonna take this free hand, go under his knee, pivot just like I'm doing an arm bar, okay? You can see why these would, would fit together, right? Because the first piece of the process is basically the same. I'm pivoting, and just like with the sweep we were doing earlier, this foot is gonna go high into his armpit at a 45 that way. This leg is gonna swing and go underneath him. Okay, so that's the flower sweep, right? Having his arm trap means he can't post, means he can't stop the sweep. But anyone who's been hit with a couple flower sweeps knows that's gonna be coming, right? So he's coming here, I'm sweeping here, or I'm, I'm hooking here and controlling, okay? Once he gets, once I get this overhook, he's gonna realize, especially once I dive here, he's gonna realize, oh, flower sweep's coming. He's gonna start trying to back out. Usually they'll take this arm, they'll kinda, yeah, and they'll try to start pulling this arm out, okay? That's when we're gonna take our opportunity to hit our arm bar. So I'm gonna cinch down on his wrist. I kinda actually want him to pull his arm out a little bit because I wanna trap the wrist right here. Pinch my elbow down, okay? So that's why you do this when they identify the flower sweep and they start countering it, okay? So once we get to here, I'm gonna cinch my elbow down and then just swing up. Okay, now we have an arm bar here or we could finish the sweep. Be real careful if you finish the sweep with your partner and then we have that arm bar there, okay? Just make sure you protect their elbow, yeah? <clears throat> Again, all right, we're here. We're going to do one of these where we swim inside, pull our knees forward, lead his hands to the mat. I overhook, okay? Pinching my elbow down. I dive under the knee, he starts to back out. I swing my leg up, arm bar, okay? Or finish the sweep, arm bar from there. Yes, yep. And make sure you're pinching that elbow so we can't just rip the sucker out of there, okay? We'll do other side <coughs> for demonstration purposes. So we're going here, swim, hook, okay? Dive under the other side, he starts backing it out. We have arm bar. We have a sweep finish, finish the arm bar there. Okay, let me get one, someone, come here, uh, come here Marcus. <clears throat> give, Josh's arm, give Josh's arm a break. Okay, let's go this way. So same thing, we're swimming, we're overhooking, okay? We're gonna dive under, go, he starts backing out. Oh, we kick our leg up, we have arm bar, or we finish the sweep. We could do a straight arm there, or here, either way. Okay, any questions? Yeah? Straight arm. <clears throat> the, just straight arm mark, yeah. Any questions? No, we all good? Okay, partner up, do it three times on each arm, and then let your partner go, and then three times on the other arm, all right? Um, do the flower sweep once, just to understand the physics of it, and then just do the arm bar. We're mostly focusing on the arm bar, okay? One, two, three.